Hello NCAA basketball fans. Welcome to Platinum Cappers, your trusted source for the best in college basketball betting picks, tips, and analysis. Today, we're looking at an exciting NCAA men's basketball matchup between the Florida Atlantic Owls and the Tulane Green Wave, set for Thursday at the historic Fogelman Arena in Devlin Fieldhouse. The Owls, with an impressive 11-4 record, will take on the Green Wave, who are not far behind at 10-4. This game is a highlight for fans and bettors alike, and we've got all the top free NCABB predictions for this high-stakes clash. The Owls have been showcasing their offensive might this season, averaging 81.9 points per game with a field goal percentage of 49.6%. Their 8.33 point attempts made per game on average underline their shooting efficiency. However, their defense hasn't quite matched up to their offensive capabilities, as seen in their mixed performance against the spread in recent games. Consistency will be key if they are to come out on top against Tulane. Tulane Green Wave, on the other hand, has an even more impressive scoring record, averaging 86.4 points per game. Their defense, marked by an average of 10.10 steals and 4.17 blocks per contest, makes them a formidable opponent. While their three-point field goal percentage may be slightly lower, their overall field goal percentage is greater than the Owls. Like Florida Atlantic, Tulane has also had mixed success against the spread, suggesting potential areas for exploitation. In terms of key player matchups, we've got John L. Davis of the Owls against Kevin Cross of the Green Wave. Davis has been crucial for the Owls, averaging 16.8 points and 6.7 rebounds per game with impressive three-point shooting accuracy. His turnover rate, however, could be an issue against Tulane's aggressive defense. Cross brings his own strengths to the court for Tulane, averaging 16.2 points and 7.8 rebounds per game. His physical presence and efficient scoring style will be vital in this matchup. The betting odds and point spread for this game are still TBD. However, Given both teams' recent performances, this matchup is expected to be an exciting contest. Betters should keep a close eye on the spread to gauge which team the oddsmakers favor. Looking at betting trends, the Owls have shown a balanced performance but have been inconsistent against the spread, especially in away games. Tulane's betting trends highlight their strong offensive game, with significant victories at home when covering the spread. This could give Tulane an advantage, but their road performances suggest vulnerabilities that can be exploited. Given these analyses and trends, this game is set to be a high-scoring affair. The key will lie in defensive strategies and how well each team can exploit the other's weaknesses. While both teams have their strengths, Tulane's robust scoring and home court advantage might give them the edge. Prop bets on individual player performances, especially on key players like Davis and Cross, could be lucrative. The over-under is also worth considering, given both teams' high scoring averages. Our free pick and prediction. Tulane Green Wave to win in a close game, with a predicted score of 78-74 over the Florida Atlantic Owls. Thanks for tuning in to Platinum Cappers for your NCAA basketball insights. Remember to like, subscribe, and share for more. Hey there! NCAA basketball fans. Welcome to Platinum Cappers, your trusted guide for NCAA men's basketball betting tips, analysis, and forecasts. Today, we're diving into an intriguing matchup between the Michigan Wolverines and the Maryland Terrapins, set for this Thursday, January 11, 2024. With the Wolverines standing at 6-9 and the Terrapins at 9-6, this game at the Xfinity Center, tipping off at 7 p.m. Eastern Time and broadcasted on FS1, is shaping up to be a crucial test for both teams as they navigate the thick of the season. The Wolverines, despite their struggles, have shown they can put points on the board, averaging 81.7 points per game. Their offensive capabilities are evident, but they faced challenges in maintaining momentum throughout games and have been inconsistent on the road. Their average of 22 of 34 game total overs in recent games points to their ability to score consistently, but defense and consistency are areas for improvement. The Maryland Terrapins, meanwhile, have been in a better position, especially when playing at home. With a strong home record of winning 16 out of 17 money line contests at the Xfinity Center, 
they've shown a more balanced approach between offense and defense. Their lower scoring average and a tendency to hit the game total under in 22 of their last 35 games suggest a slower-paced, deliberate style of play. In terms of key players, we have Doug McDaniel of the Wolverines and Jameer Young of the Terrapins. McDaniel has been contributing 17.8 points per game with an impressive 44.2% field goal percentage. His role is crucial, but his turnover rate could be a point of concern. Young, averaging 19.9 points per game with a 42.5% field goal percentage, has been a standout performer for Maryland, effective on both ends of the court. The betting odds for this matchup are still to be determined, but given the current trends and Maryland's home court advantage, the Terrapins might emerge as the slight favorites. Betters should keep an eye on these odds for insights into expected performance and outcomes. Looking at betting trends, Michigan has shown strong offensive starts but has struggled to maintain leads. Maryland, thriving at home with a preference for more controlled, defensive-minded games, makes them a solid pick in straight win markets at the Xfinity Center. Considering these factors, this game promises to be a close contest. Michigan's offensive power, especially in the first half, contrasts Maryland's defensive play and strong home record. The key for success lies in consistently breaching Maryland's defense or exploiting Michigan's second-half performances. For the best betting picks, Maryland's strong home record and balanced play make them the safer bet, particularly in moneyline and under markets. Prop bets on individual player performances, such as points scored by McDaniel and Young, could also offer value. Our free pick and prediction. Maryland Terrapins to secure a win with a score of 75-70 to over the Michigan Wolverines. Thanks for tuning in to Platinum Cappers for your NCAA basketball betting insights. Remember to like, subscribe, and share for more expert analysis and top picks. We'll see you next time for more exciting college basketball action. Hey there, NCAA basketball fans. Welcome to Platinum Cappers your premier destination for insightful NCAA men's basketball betting tips, forecasts, and picks. Today, we're looking at an intriguing matchup between the UCLA Bruins and the Utah Utes, set to take place this Thursday at the John M. Huntsman Center. With the Bruins holding a 6-9 record and the Utes at 11-4, this game is shaping up to be one of the most intriguing matches for those seeking winning NCAA BB picks. Both teams' season trajectories and performances could yield some unexpected outcomes, making this a must-watch for college basketball enthusiasts. The UCLA Bruins have had a season of highs and lows. Averaging 65.5 points per game, they've been efficient but struggled in their three-point shooting, hitting just 29%. However, their free-throw shooting at 72.1% and rebounding at 35.8 per game could be crucial. Yet. Their average of 12.2 turnovers per game might expose some weaknesses that the Utes could exploit. On the other side, the Utah Utes have been displaying robust offensive capabilities. They average a remarkable 80.3 points per game, outpacing the Bruins in scoring efficiency with a 47.7% field goal percentage and 37.4% from three-point range. Their rebounding slightly surpasses UCLA and their 17.8 assists per game show they're a team that excels in ball movement. The Utes' defense, with 7.2 steals and 4.5 blocks per game, could pose significant challenges to UCLA's offense. A key player battle to watch is between UCLA's guard Sebastian Mack and Utah's center Brandon Carlson. Mack, averaging 14.3 points and 4.2 rebounds per game, has shown his worth on both ends of the court. However, his turnover rate and three-point shooting percentage could be areas of concern against Utah's defense. Carlson, with an average of 17.6 points and 6.4 rebounds per game, is a dominant force. His ability to score both inside and outside makes him a versatile threat against the Bruins' defense. The betting odds and point spread for this game are still TBD. However, based on both teams' performances, Utah might be favored. The total odds will likely hinge on both teams' offensive and defensive efficiencies, with Utah's high-scoring nature potentially pushing for a higher total. Looking at betting trends, UCLA has shown a tendency to underperform in away games, especially in the first half and total game totals. 
Utah, on the other hand, demonstrates a preference for exceeding team totals at home, particularly during the first half, and is known for maintaining leads once established. Considering these factors, the Utah Utes seem to have the upper hand in this matchup. Their superior offensive statistics and home court advantage make them a strong pick. However, NCAA basketball is known for its unpredictability, and UCLA's resilience should not be underestimated. Prop bets on individual player performances, especially focusing on Utah's Carlson, could be interesting given his significant impact on the game. In conclusion, while the Utah Utes appear to be the favorable pick, the unpredictability of college basketball always leaves room for surprises. The over-under will be a critical aspect to watch, given the contrasting offensive styles of the two teams. Our free pick and prediction. Utah Utes to secure a victory with a score of 77-66 to over the UCLA Bruins. Thanks for tuning in to Platinum Cappers for your NCAA basketball betting insights. Remember to like, subscribe, and share for more expert analysis and top picks. We'll see you next time for more exciting college basketball.